The practical travellers have been down at Chewton Bunny Beach in Highcliffe, Dorset. And you'll never believe what we found down there. Cue the titles. This beach is Dorset's one of less well-known beaches, but it's perfect if you just want to get away from it all. There are no facilities, there is a cafe and a car park, but other than that, that's it. It's just natural. We'll show you in yellow where the beach is, the black arrow shows you where we were recording from, and the yellow marks the car park. Easy. Your signs up are there for your protection. So don't clamber up the cliffs, just stick to the path and the beach and you'll be absolutely fine. Okay, so it's not Fistral Beach, but the waves are good for surfing at times, so it's always good to just pop down and see what the conditions are like. Bolts aren't your thing? Then, if you just fancy a stroll down the beach, then this is the perfect place to come. As you can see, looking in the distance, you can see all the way over to the Isle of Wight and the Needles. This part of the beach is stony, but the rest of it as you can see, is beautiful cordon sands. The tide was out when we went, so you can see that there are miles and miles of golden sand. So keep tuned, as I said, I'm going to show you some of the delights that we found down the beach towards the end of the video. You won't believe the fossils that we found. We've also got a video all about fossil hunting down on this beach, so I'll stick a link at the end of the video for that one too. So the cliffs, the cliffs that can be unstable. This is what they look like. They're not huge cliffs, but they are soft. As long as you stay to the beach and you don't clamber on them, you'll be absolutely fine. The practical travellers do visit lots and lots of locations, so if you like what you're seeing, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I've marked it with a lovely gold arrow. Click! And back to the beach. From here, you can walk all the way down to Barton, but do keep an eye on the tide times because you don't want to get cut off or stranded. This is low tide, so you have got quite a large stretch of beach. But when it's at high tide, it will be right up to the cliffs. Hence the fact that they can be unstable and they are prone to dropping. So once again, this is a really great place for water sports enthusiasts, but do check to see what the water's doing before you head on down here. And remember that there aren't really any facilities for changing. And here we go, the bit I promised you. This is the fossil that we found down at Chewton Bunny Beach. Well, it's just one of the many fossils we found, and in the top right hand corner there'll be a link taking you to the video where we show you all about collecting fossils down at Chewton Bunny Beach. Thanks so much for watching our video, and we hope you've enjoyed it. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and the Practical Travellers will see you really soon. Bye for now!